I never laid a hand on Christina, I swear. Because she's lying. You say that again, I will blow. Honey, you... Sonny, take it easy. You got two cops here and an unarmed man, okay? You... Don't do anything stupid. You didn't hit Christina? How'd you get the scratch on your face? When I picked her up to take her to the ER, she was scared and disoriented. She lashed out, but I did not beat her. There is nothing lower than a man who beats women and children. You are garbage. And I can guarantee you one thing. You're gonna pay. Look, I would never hit Christina, okay? I was horrified when I found her. She has to be lying. Why? Well, Why would she lie about this? I don't know. Maybe she was upset from rejecting her. Rejecting her? Yeah, look, I admit, I was a little harsh with Christina when she came in here tonight, but it was the yeah, only way to get through to... You need to stop talking. You need okay? to let him explain. Look, Christina probably lied because she felt humiliated when I told her to get out of here. And everything you're saying, you're just incriminating yourself more. Lucky, all I did was grab her arm. I'm taking you down to the station. <laughs> you're under arrest. Honey, so what happened? I, I thought you were going out with Kiefer tonight. Did the, did the plans fall through? Sort of. What happened? Did he break up with you? Can we talk about this later, Mom, please? Absolutely, honey. We'll talk about it whenever you're ready, okay? All right, all right. Chrissy, I am so sorry. I should have never left you alone at that house. You are with your sister? Yeah, I was, I was, um, I, I ran into Chrissy at the, um, Metro Court restaurant and she had a bruise on her arm from Ethan and I took her home. He got mad and wanted me to leave, so he grabbed my arm. So he manhandles you in public, then takes you home, beats you up, and then drops you off at the hospital? What, does he want to look like a good guy? Yeah, well, I actually, I, um, I went to talk to him after I... What did he say? You know, he just, he, he threw a lot of attitude and he didn't have much remorse and I was pretty pissed off. I, I gotta tell you, I was, I was pissed off and I told him not to come near you again and... Oh gosh, I am so sorry. I didn't think he would take it this far. Oh, it's, it's my fault. It is not. It shouldn't have made him angry. Your fault. No, it's not your fault. You didn't do anything wrong. This is all on Ethan. Did you hear what happened? Sam got a call from Alexis. She went to the hospital. How's Christina doing? Bruises all over. Her eyes puffed. Black eye. When she told me it was Ethan, all I can think about was him pounding my little girl on the ground. Boom, sorry, boom, sorry, I'm boom. Sorry. Went to the Honda store to kill that son of a bitch. But Lucky called Dante. So, to stop me. Well, it's a good thing like he did that. Well, now with Claudia's murder, I can't, you know. I know you can't do anything right now, but listen to me. Just focus on Christina, because she's going to need your support. Oh, he's not getting away with it. Okay? This guy, Ethan, has to die, and I need you to make the arrangements. Here's what I'm thinking. Maybe you can get him in his cell tonight. What are you going to tell Luke? Okay, Lucky, this is crazy. You know I'm innocent. The victim I'm made a positive ID, man. There's nothing uh, I can do. Okay, come on. Lucky, you're a smart cop. You shall you know, to take him to the interrogation. I wouldn't do this. I, I would, no way in hell I would do this. You have a minute? I need to brief you. Sure. Wait here. Some broad at the blackjack table, or what? I wish. But this is no joke, man. I've been accused of beating Sonny's daughter. You gotta be kidding me. No, I didn't do it. All right, I argued with Christina, but I never, never hit her. So tell them that. I have, over and over again. No one believes me. 
Sonny's out for blood, and he's not gonna stop till I'm dead. That's weird. I thought I'd be in more pain. Yeah. Well, they have given you a lot of drugs. You know, the pain's probably gonna set in in the next few days, but you're gonna get through this. You told me you've been hurt like this when men hit you. Yes, I have. And those were some of the darkest days of my life. But you know what? It made me a lot stronger. And I got through it. And I know it's probably pretty hard for you to hear right now, but you can get stronger from this. You're going to learn how to define your boundaries. Sort of understand what you will and, and what you won't put up with. I can't put it all on Ethan. It, it takes two, right? I did things that made him angry. No, uh-uh. So you're, you're, you're really wrong there. It doesn't matter what you did, okay? You were not at fault here. No man should ever put their hands on a woman, period. together, okay? Okay. Okay. I'm really sorry I didn't see how much trouble you were in. I mean, I, I just didn't see all of this getting so out of control. You warned me about my feelings for Ethan. If I would have listened tonight, it would never have happened. Look, it's me again. Please, please call me back. I need to speak to Luke. I was just trying to reach him. He's in Las Vegas. Ethan assaulted my daughter tonight. Alexis, I heard your daughter was attacked, and I'm, I'm unbelievably sorry. That's it? That's as outraged as you get? Ethan says he's innocent. How convenient. He's lying. He very well may be, but as long as there's a glimmer of doubt, I'm... I need to speak to Luke now. Right. Well, he's unreachable. Find him. And when you do, tell him that his son beat the hell out of my daughter tonight and that he needs to turn himself into the authorities to be prosecuted because not only is it the right thing to do, but if he doesn't, Sonny will kill him. Not that I wouldn't enjoy it, but I don't want my daughter living through it. I truly wish it wasn't Luke's son, but this crosses the line. Ethan is Luke's son, Sonny. Who? Yeah, and he attacked my daughter. And you know what? He's not going to get away with hey, it. Well, hold on. You didn't want to kill Dante because he's your son. I can safely say that Luke's going to feel the same way. Different. How is it different? Because Dante came at me because of business. My daughter is an innocent victim. You're right. But Luke is one of your oldest friends. That, that says a lot in this business. You think I want to put trouble between me and Luke? This animal, Ethan, beat my daughter to a pulp. He needs to be put down hey. like a dog. I agree. Let's just say we take Ethan out. Sonny, kill this what, what, what if Luke comes after you? What if Luke puts us in a position that we have to kill him? I just hope that Luke can put himself in my shoes. If Michael or Dante beat Lulu to a pulp, he would want payback. Either way, Ethan dies tonight. <laughs> <laughs>